What a difference a year, not to mention the arrival of a six foot nine all-state caliber center can make for a high school basketball program. Now that is not to suggest Jackson Clark's marvelous sophomore season was the lone driving force in Keokuk flipping the script from finishing nine games under 500 a season ago to 10 games over 500 this winter. But there is also no disputing that the gifted big man changed the entire complexion of the chief program in 2024. Not just in crafting one of the finest individual stat lines anywhere to be found in Tri-State basketball this season, but just as importantly, creating even more canvas for some very gifted teammates to shine and help him lift Chief Basketball out of its doldrums. As a frame of reference, Jackson Clark saw just six games worth of somewhat nondescript action as a freshman at the varsity level. But that did not stop Zach Summers from promoting him into the Keokuk starting lineup right from the jump this year. A gambit that was instantly validated as Jackson debuted as a starter with 23 points and a whopping 18 total rebounds in an eight point win over Monroe City. It proved to be merely the leaping off point for 24 games worth of goodness to come. It goes almost without saying what a valued commodity Jackson's mix of size, strength, and dexterity are in the world of basketball. But rarely do we see that combination coupled with such great ball skill, both as a shooter and a passer. Clark finished this year averaging 19.8 points per game on nearly 66% shooting from the field. Granted, much of that came from close range where Jackson was able to overwhelm smaller defenders. I point out, however, that he also canned 17 total triples at a very impressive 37% make rate and converted 70% of his 131 trips to the charity stripe. Those are numbers comparable to the best shooting guards in our region. Keokuk, meanwhile, was getting that level of productivity from its five spot. The board work here was even more statistically impressive. His 277 total rebounds made him the 15th most prolific in that category in the state of Iowa, and the third best glass cleaner in all of Class 3A. His 107 total offensive boards were the second highest total in the class as well. Overall, he averaged 11 and a half rebounds per contest, flirting very seriously with that mythical 2010 nightly stat line that connotes true elite big man greatness. And true to form, he also blocked 52 shots, better than two per contest. I mentioned earlier the connectivity component of his game as well. Jackson proved a willing and adept inside out passer from within the paint and good enough from the high post to help his team score nearly 300 more total points this year vis-a-vis -vis last season and approve its overall shooting percentage as a team a whopping 7% from the field. By every conceivable metric, this young man impacted Keokuk basketball for the positive. And had the Chiefs found a way to upset Williamsburg in the sub-state final, we might be well talking about the Chiefs center for the biggest prize on our board. That is clearly not out of his reach in the future. But as it stands for now, however, Jackson Clark has carved out a well-earned place for himself as your 2024 KHQA breakout star of the season.